Okay, in this one, I'm going to be showing you the spider growing prank. Okay, as you can see, I got a small spider here. I'm going to place this into my hand here. I'm going to place the cloth on. Watch this. And grow that spider. I'm now going to teach you the secret. Okay, for this one, you'll need uh, uh, a scarf. You'll need a big spider and a small spider. Okay, you're going to hide the big spider in the cloth, like what you see me doing here. You're going to hold the spider up. This bacteria is going to act. What you're going to do is you're going to hold it into your hand like this. You're going to place the cloth. People will see that you're just putting a cloth on. What you're doing is you're putting the big spider on and then pulling the cloth away, giving the effect that you grew that spider. Okay, I'm now going to show you what it looks like. You can see here. F -f from here. And make it grow. And that's how you do the growing spider prank. Now I'm going to be showing you the spiders and cups. Magic trick. And a really cool prank all in one. You see? What is it with you bolting for the bathroom? You can see? Here. Okay, you can see. I'm gonna put this spider on top of the cup. These nice blue cups. Watch this. Okay. Now I'm, I'm gonna show you how this trick is done. This is actually kind of linked to like, the cups and balls. As you can see, nothing there. I have to just dip in there, so just take that and uh, put this down and then make it up here. So you can do two ways how you did that. All you need here is two black spires from your Halloween stuff and two cups. Um, tip must be not seeable. As you can see here, blue or any kind of cup. Put one spider inside. You can see here, making sure it does not fall out like that. So again, making sure it does not fall out. So that way it'll, it'll look like really good. All you gotta do is as you bash down, it's gonna come falling down. Cup goes over. Sp spider goes on top. This cup goes over that. Just like this. And then releasing that. And then doing the same again. Go like that. That way it's you know, stuck inside there. You can see here. That one, that one again. See this one again. All I gotta do is take this spider. Now right here's so where the second one comes in. Okay. You're gonna put this down here. As you tuck this on, you're gonna go ahead like that and make it reappear. So that is how you do the cups and spiders. Because we're doing things with, with spiders in this one, and I'll be uh, taking you through some other ones. Um, just I want to one, I want to show you guys is called the Matchbox uh, appearing spider trick prank. It's a very slick one, and it's a very cool one to pull off. As you can see, I have a matchbox here. Let's see. 
Let's go check like this and see. Watch this. Magically, a spider appears in the match box. I'm gonna show you how to do magic. Match box spider. All you need for this here is a fake spider and a match box. An empty match box. What you're gonna do here is gonna put the spider up top and uncover just like this. Okay? The spider is right inside there. So it's gonna slip down to here just like that. And then you open it up just like that. Okay, so that way it will give the effect. Okay, what you're gonna do again, hide it there. So that way, what, how you hold it is just like this. Okay, without the spider to show. So that way, the C is completely empty. You're going to close it. You're going to um, go down, do a little shake. And then, with your finger, push it down, revealing the spider. And that's how you do the magic matchbox spider trick gag prank. Okay, so, as it is, I'm now going to show you the um, hand candle flame gag prank. It's, uh... A really cute one you can pull off and you'll get good results and you'll get a lot of smiles with this little cute prank gag. Okay, here, can I see? Watch this. By hand. So how's this done? I'm going to now reveal the, the secret. Okay, as it is, I'm gonna show you what it is. Okay, it's a light up one. You can find these in the mall or dollar store in the candle section. This turns on, and that's what turns on the light. Okay. What you're going to do is have your thumb onto the light like this. So as you're putting it into your hand, you're going to turn it on in the same process. Covering it, snapping your fingers, moving it out just like that. And that's how you do the um, candlelight by hand gag prank. Okay, I'm going to show you what's like off. Okay, you guys see? On. And there you go. And now you know the secret behind this one of a kind slick prank. It's a very cool one to pull off. I fully guarantee it. You'll, you'll get really good results with it. This one. Okay, now I'm going to show you the hand changing prank. You can see, and then I'm just gonna go into the bag and change my hand. Okay, so how is this done? I will now reveal the secret. Okay, so what you'll need for this is pr pretty simple. All you'll need is your character glove that you've made. I've also done a video here on my channel on how to make, make your own character gloves. And you'll need to get yourself a bag or a cloth, whatever like that. All I gotta do is put your character glove into the bag, just like this. With your hand, you're gonna hold the, your character glove, just like this. So as you reach into the bag, you're going into your character glove. And then I'm putting it down into the bag. And then I'm pulling it back out. And that's how you do 
the hand chains prank. Okay, I'm not gonna show you what it looks like. Just give me a moment while I get this done. So here, so you've you've seen the revealing. And I'm not gonna show you what it looks like. Yeah, see, here, look into the bag, and there you go. Okay, I'm now gonna show you the rat scare gag prank, which is one of the most cool ones. That way, uh, you'll get everyone jump uh, jumping, and um, oh man, that would be the most slickest prank you could ever pull. As it is, I'm gonna show you in just a, a few quick nanoseconds. Okay, and there you go, the rat scare prank. So how is it? How is it this one? I'm gonna show you what you'll need. All you, you need is um, rat, um, plastic rat that squeaks. Okay, which gives a really cool effect. All the, and then what you'll, what you'll need is a brown paper bag. Okay, all you gotta do for this one, this is pretty simple. You just put the rat into the bag. Just like this. Let's see. Oh, hopefully you can see that. Yeah. Rat and bag that you see right here. And all you, all you do is Put the bag on the floor, making sure the rat is in the center of the bag. So that way, um, when someone walks, they're gonna step, creating that squeaking sound. And then all they, they gotta do is, uh, once they jump, they're gonna get that bag and reveal the rat. And watch them have an awesome time. Jumping, and that's how you do the rat bag scare prank. So that is it for another round of pranks. I want to know more about the ha more Halloween pranks. All I got do is stay tuned. I got more coming up. Uh, Tomorrow, I'll be throwing in a new batch of Halloween pranks as well, too. So, I, 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 as it is, have fun watching. Thank you for, for tuning in. Enjoy. Mmm. Tasty. I'll see you tomorrow for more awesome pranks and gags.